Hello, boys and girls. It's Miss Suzanne again. We are going to read this book today called Bounce. We read this book the other day, and I love it so very much, so we're going to read it again. It is by Doreen Cronin and Scott Menchin. It is called Bounce. Starts with a B. Bounce. Does anybody remember what the book is about? If you do, think about it. What do you think it's about? There's a dog bouncing on a ball. Let's take a look. Come on, let's bounce like a bunny. The dog is bouncing and the bunny is bouncing. Let's bounce like a frog. Ker plop, ker plop. The frog is bouncing and the dog is falling in some water. I'll bounce to the left if you'll bounce to the right. Look at all of those ballerinas dancing. Do you like dancing? Bees bounce in the daytime. Bats bounce in the night. You can bounce a ball right off your hands or bounce it off your toes. Look at these two balls we have here. Remember these? The volleyball and the soccer ball. Those are fun games to play. I can bounce a beach ball on the tip of my nose. Can you? If you bounce into a puddle, it's best to bounce in boots. Look, he's wearing rain boots so that when he bounces in the puddle, his feet don't get wet. If you must bounce in the market, it's best not, not to bounce in fruits. Take a look at that picture right there. Do any of these fruits look like balls to you? I think all of these are round and they all look like balls. These are oranges and strawberries and cherries, grapes. This is a grapefruit. Bouncing with your best friend is called a bouncing double. Bouncing on the couch is called big bouncing trouble. It's hard to bounce in roller skates. It's fun to bounce on poles. That's called a pogo stick. When you stand on this and you bounce, 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 it's a type of toy that makes you bounce high. If hippos bounced from place to place, imagine all the holes. If bouncing in the sun gets hot, bounce back into the shade. Is it a hot day today? Maybe go to your window and look outside. Is it a hot day? Is it a colder day? Is it raining? Go check it out. Let's see what the next page says. If bouncing makes you thirsty, bounce yourself to lemonade. Mmm, he's taking a nice big sip of lemonade. Who likes lemonade? I do. A bounce can turn into a bump. A bump into a fall. Oops. But it's better to have bounced and bumped than never to have bounced at all. Look at the doggy. He has all these band-aids and bumps and bruises, but look, he's so happy still. He's smiling, he's happy, because he had a really good time bouncing. If you like that book, put your hands on your head. If you didn't like the book, put your hands on your shoulders. I like the book, so I'm gonna put my hands on my head. I thought it was a really great book. 
So I have one more question for you before we go on. How do you bounce a ball? So can you find a ball in your house and take it? And if it's a nice day, I want you to go outside and bounce, bounce, bounce the ball. This is how you bounce. You take the ball in your hand and you throw it to the floor and it's supposed to bounce up. It's supposed to come on up. And that's how you bounce a ball. Do you have a basketball or a tennis ball? Maybe you have a soccer ball. Try it when you go outside today and see what happens, okay? And also what I want you to try, I want to try for you guys to bounce. Can you bounce? Bouncing is like jumping. Can you go down real low and bounce? Let's see if you can do that. Send us a picture. I hope you guys like the book. Bounce. It's a great book. Bye, guys.